Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 1, Episode 11 Thoughts. This episode is called The Magical Place. Spoilers for the MCU leading up to and including this episode. No spoilers for anything later in the MCU. Another episode I love. Before I get into it, the top link in the description box will enable you to donate to the second half of Strikers. I implore you to do so. And then there are some links to videos that help explain why this is such an important strike. So, let's get into it. Yeah, uh, quite enjoyed them capturing Van Camp at the start with the Roomba and the drones and sky hacking the elevator. Yeah, that was, uh, yeah, good stuff. And <laughs> they they get an alert that they're being hacked and it's Sky and it's like, ah, there you go, there you are. Can you remove the, <laughs> just, yeah. And, yeah, I will say, at first, it's Melinda May saying no to the question did seem really harsh. And then later you realize, no, like, you know, based on, yeah, you know, she, yeah, she was saying no, she's more useful for the mission if she's not on the on the bus so yeah and <laughs> you make me a sandwich yes that's what this is exactly <laughs> and the the thing with uh, you know what do you what am I gonna be able to do I'm gonna be in a what did she say a broom closet a shield broom closet for the next several days that is true. There are, you know, people coming to to take you away. Ha ho ho he. In twelve minutes, you know. So yeah. And yeah, we we get the stakes that if Phil AC, if he keeps fighting the machine, he will die. And we're told that like Ace. Uh, Colson also lost his father as a kid. Yeah, quite liked uh, the guy stealing the guy's car and crashing it. And uh, do you need any medical assistance? I'm good. Which is a nice little, you know, she's yeah, she's she's bragging to the audience and herself, but to the OnStar, you know, she's saying I'm I'm you know. I'm still healthy. I'm not injured. And Ward tosses the the guy out the 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 plane. You know, the, ah, the yeah, not not to the point where he actually does. Yeah. Um. The the. Yeah, so that was very, you know, pro-torture, not a big fan of that. And yeah, Coulson, I, I really like, you know, when he wakes up, he see one of the figures he sees is one of these, you know, dolls, like it's mannequins, you know, since it's this testing range. And now he used one to, to you know... To make it seem like he was in in the bed, which got him the drop on the guard, but he is, you know, he can't possibly just like walk out of there. there you know, there's hundreds of miles of desert around, and Poe did have a guard stand close by to to grab Colson. Dollar bills, y'all. Which wow. And yeah, we really hate the. The what was his name again? The the guy Lloyd. You know he's he's really ugh. so it's very fun seeing Sky stick it to him. And yeah, Sky <laughs> calls the calls the office, gets him to to come home. S claims that she's Melinda May and threatens he'll go to the fridge, which I guess you know she's like trying to get Melinda May in trouble 
Because, like, he's going to contact S.H.I.E.L.D. and be like, I can't believe what Melinda, what your agent Melinda May did. And the, the fridge, which I like, because this is like, I mean, based on the other ones we've been told about, that does sound like a thing that they would have. And... Let's see... Yeah, Agent Hand. You know, not a fan of the fact that... Um, Ward went against her orders. I th forgot to, to mention the other time, you know, uh, obviously always great to see Saffron Burrows in something. Glad she's back. No single agent is that important. Well, Loki killed him before he was able to marry the Portland bases. I really appreciate she still has no name. I wonder if we're ever going to learn the name of the Portland bassist because they just keep saying, you know, oh yeah, she, you know, Portland has a great Philharmonic orchestra and, you know, she really loved you. It's just, yeah. And Poe is killed by the Crap, I forget. I keep forgetting his name. Um, yeah, it is just not coming to me. Uh, the Psychic, let's go with that. And Reyna doesn't even bat an eye. And, you know, later Coulson does, you know, point out, I've seen how you treat your friends. And, yeah, this is when in the episode we learn that Melinda May wanted Sky off the plane for the good of the mission. And Sky showing Lloyd her badge was a very clever, you know, because he thinks that, you know, she's saying, oh, look, all I got to do is, is, you know, say this, this code and they're going to shut down. Your, and, and he's like, oh, I was doing so well in the app, though. I was, you know, I, I forget the name of that, but he was playing a, a game on the, on the smartphone. But yeah, you know, obviously we, the audience, know that it's because of the, the bracelet. And... Let's see... And, and, you know, she has the line, kids need someone to look up to, which is, of course, based on her own experience. And Reyna says of, of Mike and, um, I'm sorry, I forget the name of the, the Chinese, uh, I'll have, Scorch, you know, um, Chan Ho Yin, you know, she says, I gave them what they asked for, which, <laughs> Yeah, that is one way to look at it. And Lloyd is slow to type and explains, you know, I mean, I usually have an assistant to do these things for me. So, you know, one of the security guards is actually faster. And Reyna really pushes Coulson and uses the, the bassist. <laughs> and, and, yeah, Ward is like, that sounds like riding a bull for eight seconds. And the response is, yeah, it's that simple. And, yeah, Sky calls Gemma and says, Don't lie, you're terrible at it. <laughs> Remember the safe word, Manscaped? Oh, I shouldn't have said that. And, and Melinda May's like, get out. to the, Because the, it's like, okay, we're not going to get anything. It, this is not going to go well if Gemma has to keep trying to lie. And, yeah, we see the, the doctor... Dr. Stryton, who was in an earlier episode, I think it was the pilot in Tahiti. But, you know, so yeah, Colson sees the operating room, but he claims that all he sees is darkness. Got creepy. And, yeah, Colson was begging to be allowed to die, and he does also in the, you know, the present in the... Ah, what's it called? The the bed. The machine. 
and we see his exposed brain. Yikes. And uh, let's see. Right, and the yeah, they they say, you know, there will be no flower dresses in Reyna's immediate future. And the disengage bracelet, which that was kind of cute. And then, you know, Coulson talks to Dr. Stryton, and we're told he was dead for days. They did operations that no good doctor would allow. Stryton was brought in for the seventh. He lost the will to live, and, you know, they, they adjusted his memories to, to change who he was from the just, yeah. Um, and, and, yeah, that does explain, you know, when they were giving him back the will to live, that made him, you know, the, yeah, that changed his, his personality. You know, the, the, maybe there was some connection between the part of him that wanted to die from the, you know, and the part that was more hard-ass before. And then we see that Mike survived, and now he's being controlled through the the eye commands so yeah um i think that is everything that i have to say about the yeah um it's it's the um, yeah this was a, a it was a good way to to finish off the you know last episode ended with a cliffhanger which was the first in the in the run so far. This was a, a satisfying way to to finish it off. Uh, you know they they spend the entire episode f rescuing Coulson, so it's not one of those you know as I love a lot about Alias, but it was really it got old. How for the let's see. Was the first season and a half, or was it just the entire first season? I, I forget exactly, but they would just end one episode after another on a cliffhanger, and then resolve it in, like, the first 30 seconds of the next episode. And it was like, I mean, if not for your worry that the show would get cancelled, you could have actually finished that story in the, the episode so that it didn't have a cliffhanger, and... Yeah, I appreciate, you know, this basically feels like they had enough story for two entire episodes, so they split it into two entire, you know, in, instead of trying to trim it down so much. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so not a fan of torture. I did like the reveal that, you know, the, the, the interrogation chamber can, you know, open up and the... Yeah, and it does feel like the kind of thing that they would do. I think that might be <clears throat> right. I like that. You know, we're we're told that they're making that Shield is doing a lot to shut down Centipede, but then the the post credit scene says there's definitely still some. You know, they're not one hundred percent shut down. I think that is everything that I have to say about this one. So, yeah, until tomorrow. Manscaped. Oh, I shouldn't have said that.